Question. Explain the procedure of finding specific heat of solid experimentally. Aim. To find the specific heat of given solid. Material required. Calorimeter. Thermometer. Stirrer. Water. Steam heater. Wooden box. And lead shorts. Procedure. Measure the mass of the calorimeter along with the stirrer. The mass of the calorimeter is equal to M1. Now fill one third of the volume of the calorimeter with water. Measure its mass and its temperature. Mass of the calorimeter with water is equal to M2. Therefore, the mass of water is equal to M2 minus M1. The temperature of water in the calorimeter is equal to T1. Take a few lead sheets and place them in hot water or steam heater. Heat them up to a temperature of 100 degrees Celsius. Let this temperature be T2. Transfer the hot lead shots quickly into the calorimeter with minimum loss of heat. We will observe that the mixture settles to a certain temperature after some time. Measure this temperature T3 and the mass of the calorimeter along with contents. Mass of the calorimeter along with the contents is equal to M3. Mass of the lead sheets is equal to M3 minus M2. Since there is no loss of heat to the surroundings, we can assume that the entire heat lost by the solid is transferred to the calorimeter and water to reach the final temperature. Let the specific heats of the calorimeter, lead shots and water be SC, SL and SW respectively. According to the method of mixtures, we know the heat lost by the solid is equal to the heat gained by the calorimeter plus the heat gained by the water. M3 minus M2 into SL into T2 minus T3 is equal to M1 into SC into T3 minus T1 plus M2 minus M1 into SW into T3 minus T1. SL is equal to M1 SC into T3 minus T1 plus M2 minus M1 into SW into T3 minus T1 divided by M3 minus M2 into T2 minus T3. Knowing the specific heat of the calorimeter and water, we can calculate the specific heat of the solid.